Welcome back, I'm here with Dalmont and today we're going to be looking at another ship in the lineup review. So what's the name of this baby? This is the SFW Polaris. The Polaris. I think we may have looked at it in a work in progress state, but not in a fully fitted... Indeed. And it has been featured in many videos, but... Uh, We've never had a proper go no, through. No, no, so let's do that. I'm just going to finish my slow pass around it, and then I'll meet you where? At the back, at the side, underneath? Uh, there's a couple different places we could go, but I'm going to go ahead and start with the... Uh, I'll open up one of the side hangers, or actually... Well, depends. Do you want to look at the, the back front? Maybe, maybe the back, the very back. Start at the back. There's right. a few different entrances, but the back hangar, I think, is uh, one of the best, because you get to come in and see the max and everything. I love that there's a manticore and a, a bat right behind us. That's pretty yeah, legit. <laughs> I know. I need to get onto them, you know. <laughs> right. Let's see. Yeah. Just... Nope. Candy. Right. And I'm in. I'll hang on to this. Right. Good plan. So then, we've got the hangar with the signature hallway ribbing. Oh yes, and the NX-01s. And the NX-01 mechs. And then what have we got here? Some fighters? Yep, those are uh, missile fighters. Missile fighters? Well, technically they're drones, but whatever. Uh, and doesn't then really a, matter. A nice chunky looking airlock at the end, yeah? Yes, indeed. Is that where we're what's, going? Uh, yep, but what's really cool about this is the uh, my favorite part is the side hangers. Okay. So actually, each one of these fighters inside, and it, and it carries another four on the outside. Yep. Uh, they all have their own dual hanger bay, so you can um, actually open this up. That's very well thought out. I like that. It's nice. Elegant. Works. I have to give some uh, credit to Saber too with the exterior of this thing. I was having a bit of a roadblock and he made a few suggestions for the wingy bits. Nice. Alright, so here is the airlock. And we have gravity as well. Nice. I don't typically have gravity. It's right behind you. Yeah, look at that. We have a, we have a call run. Yeah, I wanted to do something a little bit different with the uh, conduits and stuff, but, uh... Hmm, that's interesting. Hmm, that's cool. Alright, moving on. That's really nice. It's got a nice green glow. As you can see, if you look up, Ooh. the uh, conduit line actually follows. Oh, so there's a bit of continuity. I love... just... And it actually goes uh, up Dude, and this down. Dude, cor this corridor... <laughs> this corridor... Oh, man. Yeah, if you follow that conduit line, it actually down. goes up and down, and it's functional as well. So we'll go up top here first, I guess. I was just having a little look-see at the middle before looking at what's through the windows. Computer oh, stuff. Oh yes. Computer this is stuff here, and plants and things over there. So red on the right, green on the left. So we can open this one. Green side and this has a little, a little little sprinklers. Yeah, a little bio area. Oh yes. Room for things and stuff. I need some plants for dinner. Seven seven plants. Seven plants. No onions. No onions. It's a shame I like onions, but there's no room in space for grilled onions. Indeed. Okay. All right, now we got to come upstairs. There's an upstairs area as well. Oh, very It's nice. all kind of highly compacted. Wow, yeah, I didn't expect that. That's cool. Yeah, but it need, needed some crew quarters as well. Very good. And we can come back down here. And actually, something to note is the center console actually has functional parts to it. Uh, as well. Oh, cool. Pabbing. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Very good. 
So this is obviously crew quarters as well. This is Medbay. Oh yes, I My see. personal favorite Medbay. And this is why you were saying about the thing. That's a good exactly. idea. Exactly. <clears throat> because you can repair people's heads. And then there's actually a special surgical bay for serious emergencies. Ooh, wow, with full body coverage. Well, Indeed. there you go, see? And that is how you heal the player. Help me! <laughs> Save the song. And repair me. Right, sweet. Looks proper cool when the uh, beams are coming down, too, I have to say. Oh, really? Wow, nice. Well. Wow. Where's the computer for it? Show me. You might be able to see it. Let's, uh... For some reason it won't let me in. Ah, oh, that's alright. Moving on. <laughs> that's alright. We've got a command chair. A stately command chair. Indeed. Where you can look at things and stuff, but not actually. <laughs> yeah. There's another one for uh, the first game of picture in picture. Picture in picture. Oh yeah, I'd love to be able to see the outside and project it on a screen. Oh right, okay, I see. Yeah, so a couple of blocks that could somehow link the TV, to a camera. Basically. Yeah, if they could just like link to a camera, maybe. Who knows? Don't know. Who knows? Yeah, this baby's got a pretty modest interior comparatively. Well, there's two floors in one room. That's uh, pretty unique. Central command console. Various other concepts in place. Yep, as is expected from you, sir. Another outstanding ship, but yeah. Maybe I'm biased. <laughs> you guys can tell me what you think in the comments section below. But I like this ship. I'm a big fan of these builds, and uh, yeah. Twelve thought out, etc. What else? What more could you ask for? It's got all the goodies. Yeah. Also has uh, 87,000 DPS coming out of that primary cannon in the front. Give it, give it a blip for us. Oh, I'm not in it. Oh damn! You're floating outside. Whoops. It'll take, it'll take me two seconds. My bad. All right, here we go. It's a particularly interesting gun. I must say. All right, so we're about to fire. It. Oh yes. It's a bit of a cookie cutter. There's actually a version of this uh, saved with the uh, front section completely hollowed out, and that's going to be used for the weapon update of giant Blarg laser. Oh yeah, we've been we've been seeing it uh, in use <laughs> uh, a few times recently. In a couple of oh the, yes. Uh, stream highlights that came out. So I know we've seen it, but no one's really taken a good look at it. So I'm going to give it one more pass over the hull exterior. So pause now. <laughs> and Take pause <notes>. now. <laughs> so yeah. Underneath it also has one of those uh, now very popular minus turrets for yeah. another twenty thousand DPS on top of it. Sold out, aren't they? What now? Sold out. Oh yeah, they we've out got a limited stock of the red ones, but that's it. And nobody wants the red ones. 